Assalamualaikum and good day. My name is Nur Shafura, AE190126. Today, I will be presenting on question 5.1 and 5.2 for Lab 2 MPE. So, for question 5.1, the purpose of the continuity test in wiring installation. Continuity is the presence of a complete path for current flow. A continuity test is a test that is for a quick check to see whether the circuit is open or closed. A digital multimeter sends a small current through a circuit to measure resistance in the circuit. Um, can continuity test determines first if the fuse is good or blown, second if the conductors are open or short, if the switches are operating properly, and fourth if the path of the circuits are clear as in accomplished by the circuit or conducting tracer. For question 5.2, discuss the polarity test in wiring installation. Polarity testing is a test that creates a circuit using a conductor and single pole device. By breaking the circuit, when they're operating the device, the reading of the instrument will change and thus confirm that the device must be connected in the phase conductor. There are two ways to conduct the polarity test. Um, the first method is uh, by creating a circuit by taking a lighting circuit and putting a temporary link between phase and circuit uh, protective conductors at the consumer's unit and our instrument lamp holders. When operating the light switch, the instruments will change and change back to the first reading. If it does not change at all, then the switch is connected to the neutral which is not a good sign. And for the second method is, the face and the link will simply link together at the board and put the instrument across the face and neutral at the socket. If the CPC face is reversed, then there will be no reading recorded on the instrument. Thank you. I will pass to my next member. Here, I got two switches, uh, but for each switch can light up two lamps. So when I turn on the switch, two lamps will light up. Uh, same goes to this one, but this one, uh, one lamp has can light up for some reason. So, yes. Assalamualaikum and good day. My name is Nur Shamira binti Nur Wasita, Matrix AE 1929. So, I will explain for the discussion part in this lab session. Uh, two way switch is a device that can isolate and control a circuit at two location and it is consists of three terminal which is common L1 and L2 depends on the maker. Usually, uh, two way switch are used to control the circuit more than one location as we already know there are two types of um, end circuit which are lighting circuit and power circuit for instance the lighting circuit is used for running low power rating device and the power circuit is used for running high power device the maximum load that can be connected to one end circuit with 6 ampere mcb rating is 10 points of lamp and fan in this lab session, we sketch our own house plan layout and label all the switch and lighting point that consists of two-way switch and the house plan. We simply use a board pen and F4 papers to sketch the plan layout. We also name each symbol used in the sketch to properly recognize. For example, two-way symbol, fan symbol, lamp symbol and others. Thus, we can possibly understand the electrical wiring installation in residential building lighting circuit. Therefore, we add dot line 
uh, for the wiring line and the electrical wiring in our residential. After we done sketching of the house plan layout, we also draw the wiring diagram for the two-way switch for our understanding. Anyways, there are one issue that we have whereby not all redis residential have two-way switch installation. Therefore, from this lab, we have knowledge on electrical wiring accessories symbols and have skill to draw the house plan layout and wiring um, regarding to the issue about not not all residential have two-way switch installation which is my house don't have two-way switch uh, so I cannot show how two-way uh, two switch uh, working in my house so that's all from me thank you Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Nurdani Binti Mama Israel. My metric number is 810111. So now I'm presenting conclusion part. So to summarize, we can now define single phase electrical wiring installations for lighting circuit. Not include one nose lamp connection controlled by one uh, one unit one way switch in residential building. And also we draw the wiring diagram for the circuit using the information provided in this report. Now we have a better understanding on how wiring codes work. We also have the ability to identify the type of lighting circuit and also the experiment was conducted in our own home. Next, we now finally know how to use the relevant tools appropriately for the job and we also know how to build house plans and circuit wiring diagrams as well as understanding electrical wiring, accessories and symbols. In easy words, after completing this experiment, we now have a thorough understanding of how to insert a two-way input switch in our own house. So that's all from us. Thank you.